it going, everybody? Oh, uh, happy Friday. So, I was not expecting to be streaming today. But, uh, things happen. Um, plain, uh, uh, plain to be told that, um, um, Normally, uh, normally, like, uh, I've been on a health kick for the last month, and, um, I accidentally hurt myself yesterday during a workout, and so, <coughs> excuse me, and so, so right now I cannot, like, do the type of workout I want to do today, so... So I have to rest. Uh, rest it. So I'm already. Uh, so I'm already awake, and so instead of just staying in bed until work, I might as well just stream for uh, stream for a bit until then. So uh, let's get started. Let's uh, get uh, the audio going. All right. Um, I was getting things settled. Master Pummel like Poppy's new capabilities. Um, back what was it? Uh, Wednesday. I said I was working on um off screen on um poppy swap yeah this is what i came up with uh i got her energy converter to 800 i figured that will be good for now i typically uh typically get her to about like a thousand so about the uh um towards the end of the the end of the story and that's about, uh, uh, and that's about usually what I typically, uh, uh, get her at. Um, roll CPU. I got her take mod two. And that's about as, as good as you're going to get for now. Uh, earth, uh, uh, earth element is good because I love, uh, volcano. Uh, I got AC, AC system reset and accuracy up three. I got affinity, affinity max barrier two. I got affinity max boost three, frontal force three, and, affin uh, and another affinity max boost three. Then I got arts aggro boost three, so increase her uh, aggro when she uses arts. And then aggro boots one. I couldn't get uh, I couldn't get um, another aggro boost one. Let me see if I could find like an aggro boost. Let's see. Can I find aggro boost? Ooh, aggro boost two. Uh, let me put that. Let me put that right there. Alright, so this should be a pretty significant poppy right now. Uh, I'm pretty content uh, I'm pretty content with Poppy right now. Um let's see, Pyra She is as good as I want her at right now with critical up and uh, infinity max attack. And then uh, Electra yeah, that's about as good as I'm gonna get it. Um, another thing, uh, with uh, Tiger Tiger, one thing I did not um mention, you can also get rare core crystals. 
Uh, you can also get core crystals uh, through Tiger Tiger. I happen to, uh, to stumble across a rare core crystal when uh, uh, during Tiger Tiger. So, I'm actually gonna unlock one core crystal. Uh, that rare core crystal I found in Tiger Tiger. Before we start, so let's see what we got. That's a dog, I believe. Yep. Those are always, uh, dogs are always twin rings. Yeah, that was... I mean, you will be useful later, but way later. <laughs> I, w I really wish uh, your name was Kuja. That would have been hilarious. Okay. Enough uh, Awakening Blades for now. So now we'll actually get started. So let's actually go and r try to rescue Nia. There is Titan Warship! Hmm, quite the impressive Titan. Another sign that Morardain is readying once more for war with Uriah. Look, that route goes right to the ship, just like Pyra said. Yes, yes! We should be able to climb down over here. Let's go. Okay. Off we go! Understood. All right. So now, if we go over here... You'll see that the um, the gate to the um, the base is uh, locked. These guys on a t oh. has many amazing places in it. Perhaps rest and enjoy view for a bit. Well, you can't um, get in this way, but for some reason, they don't see you go in this way. Come on, come on. And, uh, you'll sneak in this way. Hop your way down. Gotta be very careful, because... Oh, uh, like, I, uh, one time I actually tried to speed run it, and then I actually fell. <laughs> Yeah, just so you know, if you jump down from there, you'll die. Alright, another on. collection point. Clarity Moss, some binding roots. I'm derived. <laughs> All in one piece. Ooh. Well, um, this thing, um, has a use, but much later, and it, it involves a blade we don't have. So now, you'll see there is a entrance to the, um, the base, or the Titan Warship. And now, cutscene. Looks pretty high. Give me a moment. Pyra, you first. I'll pull you up, so hold tight. Yeah. 
so heavy. What? What did you say? <laughs> <laughs> Yow! Now look here, Rex. You can't just go and call a lady heavy. Oh, Rex, Rex, a little tactless. Sorry about that. I guess I was just surprised. No, no, it's not your fault. I... Oh, she heavier than Tora for sure. <laughs> but that just means Hyra grown to impressive height. It is a good thing. Hyra should be proud. Our people, Pyra up. Three, grab again. Nice puppy. Puppy, artificial brain. This is no problem. Puppy could lift Gonzalez if necessary. Oh, poor Pyra. <laughs> poor Pyra. How dare you, Rex? She is not heavy. She is thick. How dare you? You watch your damn mouth. Anyway. Now that we're on the Titan warship. No! You lost the upper hand. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know these things were aggressive. I guess I was very uh, uh, higher level than every other time I was here. Ooh, poor crystal. Toasty, toasty. If you really want to feel toasty, give me some ingredients in half an hour. <laughs> if you really, want, uh, really want something toasty, call me fat again. All right, uh, let's uh, unlock that core crystal. And I'll skip. Another dog. All right. Let's kick its ass. Let's beat it up. Beat it up, beat it up, beat it up. Taste of blood. These are uh, names of attacks or something. good to switch up blades because some of the combos can uh, uh, can help out depending on what you need. And that uh, that will change depending on how many party members you have. So once we get uh, Nia back, um, wow, world has many amazing places in it. things will, uh, things will get better. All right. Don't forget. This guy used to have one of the best lines ever. All right, Tora grew to level nine. Oh, stabbed and stabbed in the ass. Stabbed in the ass, the worst way to go. All right, um, 
go to this bank. Calm your mind. So if we didn't have Poppy, we wouldn't this break in would not be possible. Alright. So now we'll go over here. Master Pond, Poppy can feel there is a blade in the vicinity. Oh, but how can Poppy tell that? Unclear. Poppy feel other blade like wave in air. Huh. I'm not sure I get it, but maybe Dromark is nearby. Let's try opening up some of these doors. Anyone, did I? Everyone check your eyebrows. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's hard to judge the power sometimes. Pyra. Rex. Dromark. It's good to see you alive. It's very good. You see, Master Bon? There was a blade here. Master Titan, and forgive me, but who are they? Dromark. We don't have much time. Do you know where Nia is? But of course. We are in residence after all. I feel her presence. Then let's go. We can't let her get executed. Indeed. This way. And so now we have... Technically we have a... Uh, draw mark with us. I wonder if... um. If, if it tells us we have a draw mark with us. No. Nope. Back in Xenoblade 1, it tells us if, like, we have, like, a guest with us, but I right, guess not. Alright. So we'll head this way. Let's show him a thing over Let's me. mess this guy up. Let's mess him up. Oh, Rex Dex, uh, uh, Rex Dex, Rex Darity, that, that's what it was called. Break resistance. Let's open up this door. We need to open up, uh, uh, we need to turn this valve. Yeah, because uh, that uh, steam will kill you. I remember dying on that steam for so uh, so many times, and I couldn't figure out why. God, I keep missing. Alright, now let's go over here. Let's attack this person. Time to take you down. We can do this together. Wait, where'd Poppy go? Why are these oh my goodness? Oh, I forgot to hit the valve. Uh, bad tracking. Bad tracking. Yeah, because I want that treasure chest. You're all mine. 
another core crystal. And now I'll jump over here. Okay, time to take you down. And that's how. Uh, um, Don't forget. And that's how you uh, speed through this, and you don't have to go down those stairs again, or the ladder again. Really want to feel toasty? Give me some ingredients and half an hour. Yeah, uh, some uh, some of the lines kind of repeat themselves. Uh, I need to start using Electra more. Not to boast, but that was spectacular, right, Grunts? Uh, which... There it is. Is uh, level four yet? That is going to be super hard to do. there. Mm -hmm. Got it. It's very hard to use uh, Electra. So bear with me on that. I should probably, uh, let's see. I'm gonna increase anchor shot. Uh. Yeah, um, WP, uh, uh, weapon points are gonna be, uh, very helpful whenever we get new blades with different weapons. And then let's go to Tora. Uh, what I want to do is get a uh, change a uh, big boost and put it on the top spot. And then change that, uh, level it up because a topple art is going to be really good once we get back Nia. Affinity chart. Uh, 
I'm gonna... Piece of cake! Time for a break! Yeah, so this um, will allow Tora to use um, big boosts, like, at the start of a battle. So, and like, in conjunction with uh, Nia, whenever she uses her break art. So, so I can, uh, so that way I'll be able to instantly topple some, uh, topple an enemy. Uh, which, oh, which one? This one. Let's increase, on, uh, let's increase, um, Tora's HP. Alright, now let's go to Rex, and let's go to his infinity chart. Alright. Increase his agility. Yeah, the, uh, uh, let, uh, let, uh, let you use a driver art after canceling a driver art. That is huge. Like, and that is my favorite skill in the game because it helps you speed up your art recharge so damn much. Nice one! Like, that's honestly, uh, uh, like, that's, like, the first thing I go for. Like, for every character. Is to make sure that is unlocked. Like, it makes things hell of a, a lot easier. Oh, shit, I'm, I'm going the wrong way. Oh, treasure chest. Treasure quiet. Okay. I keep pressing the wrong buttons. You're all mine. Ooh, bronze chip. That will be useful. Okay, bring it on. Let's mess up, doggy. Let's mess you up. By the way, um, for those who are watching, um, Kevaloko Five. Um, uh, right now we're playing Xenoblade Chronicles 2. The reason why I'm playing this game, uh, I love this game. Um, if you like what you see, hit the follow button. Uh, but I appreciate all that's watching. No doubt about it. That's the place. Who are you people? They're the parents, friend. We are her friends, but I won't let you call her a terrorist. Okay, time to take you down. No, to be here! Be honest, be devoted! You're the only one to protect Master's Day! Let's see. I Let's all shut you up. The volcano is very good. Oh, 
There we go. I didn't think anyone was coming at all. As if we'd leave you. Always help those who help you. That's the second rule of the salvages code. Well, that's you all over, ain't it? Rex, Rex! Tora has found escape route! Hurry, hurry! And not by. He has been of some assistance. We made a new friend. Um, uh, nice to meet you. Well... I think we've overstayed our welcome here. Time to get moving. <laughs> All right, now we got three party members. Now we got uh, now we got a full squad of an attacker, a defender, and a healer. Which uh, now that's what uh, what they're gonna freaking explain. What's up, Anthony? How's it going, man? But yeah, like I was uh, like I was telling you, um, uh, like on uh, Messenger. What do you think? Uh, what do you think the next blade I'm gonna pull? I'm actually uh, I'm actually legit curious. Yeah, cause I'm thinking about pull, uh, pulling a blade for Nia. Uh, yeah, like, uh, yeah, um, damn it. All right, um, so now, as we're going through, we go through the armory door. Oh, that would, <laughs> that would be so fucked up, because I want that for Rex so damn bad. Looks like that's the way out. Sounds like our way out of here. Bam, bam, bam. Door is locked. No way. Uh, I'm not open. Even Poppy not able to break through this. But we're so close. Rex, take a look over there. Good idea. Could that be a switch to open it? We don't have any options but to try. If it does open the door, we should be able to escape through the hangar. What are we waiting for? Looks like we'll have to leave this room for now and find a way up there. Dude, bacon sounds so good right now. Alright. Now that I have Neon. She needs another blade. But before I do that, I'm gonna rectify something that I should have done with Rex on last stream. Put the punnet choker on the person you're putting, uh, uh, you're awakening blades. Yes. Please do that. Like, it will help your chances. Good grief. I don't know, uh, I don't know if you would get, like, any particular blade, but I might have not gotten a lecture. Or, I don't know, or just maybe my luck is that shitty. Who knows? Like, I realized, uh, I realized that, like, after I was done, um, 
I think I was at, uh, almost done with the, uh, the stream. And I screamed internally for at least a good 10 seconds. All right. We're gonna go until we unlock uh, unlock a blade for Nia. Oh, I said I was gonna go until I unlocked a, uh, a rare blade, and the first one was Electra. I was pissed. Yeah, so I committed to Electra. At least it wasn't Godfrey. At your service. I would have uh, I would have screamed if it was Godfrey. I'll still scream if it's Godfrey now. About these boosters, um, they will increase your idea uh, your idea points to uh, whatever. Uh, um, whatever booster it goes to, to make it whatever, uh, uh, to whatever point it goes to, um, you got your bravery points, your truth points, your compassion points, and your justice points. Each, uh, each goes to two certain type of elements. Bravery is water and fire. Truth is wind and ice. Compassion is uh, electric and earth. And justice is light and dark. Ether damage. I will do all that I can to serve you. Well, at least it's a break art for me. <laughs> yeah. Just so you know, if uh, the one in a thousand blade shows up on that, just so you know, I will scream. I will do all that I can to serve you. Oh shit! Wrong, uh, wrong button. Wrong button. I've unlocked so many uh, blades, like through like the thousand hours I've played this. Like I can almost guess. That's a dog. And that's just to find you know who. Like I'm not gonna uh, I'm not gonna say the one in a thousand blade because of spoilers and you. And Anthony, you better not, uh, and you better not say that name too, because you know better. I want to make sure anybody who uh, who uh, hasn't played this game, like, uh, be spoiler free.
and I vow to guide you to victory. Well, at least this is why I'm going through the common blade, uh, the common core crystals first. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. At this point, it's just force a habit when I'm playing by myself. Well, at least it, uh, it sounded better in my head. I have not seen an L speed run. I might need to, uh, I might need to check that out. Yo, send me uh, uh, uh send me a, a link to that in uh, Messenger. Spear. Might need that. I might need to look up the stuff that I need for a certain side quest. All right. Time for the uh, time for the rares. Yeah, I remember uh, an, uh, Emil talking about Anel a lot. God. Earth. Some of the uh, some of these random names suck. Interesting. I had a feeling it was going to be her. I'm more than okay with that for her. A good break art for uh, another good break art for Nia. Yeah. Dark Blade. Okay. Okay then. Azami. And it boosts her ether, so yeah. Together at last. <laughs> okay. My thoughts on Azami. Personally. She scares the living shit out of me. I hate dolls. I hate dolls. They scare the shit out of me. They freak me out. Um, and you'll see from her character, she's borderline psycho bitch. Okay. Now... Oh, do I want to waste this bronze chip on her? You know what, with the power she has, yes. Uh, it's a shame. I, like I love, uh, I love how her gun looks, or her like 
her starter gun looks. It, it's so uh, it's so cool. Uh, uh. Well, I have a feeling a zombie might have been my pity blade. If a zombie is my pity blade, then I'm actually excited. Which would mean I got Electra out of stupidity. Alright, time to murder. Time to murder. eventually. I'll start using, uh, I'll start using it in chapter three. Which, I mean, I've been using, uh, I started using the, um, the expansion pass, so. Probably gonna regret this. Oh, yeah, the DLC blades are stupid good. Which is why I didn't want to use them now. It, uh, it would have been unfair for, uh, for this early in the game, and you know that. Oh uh, my! Like Anthony, you know, uh, you know, um, those blades are unfair at this point of the game. Okay. I know you do. Remorseful, uh, Baklav. I don't know how to pronounce that. That is a unique monster, I guess. But, uh. Oh boy! This is gonna be fun. Alright, I need to. I need to strategize this. Let's see. Let's see. I could do fire. Uh, I could do fire, water, fire. Um, I did four, uh, let's see how many cyclones I did. I did four of them. I didn't do, uh, I didn't do the DLC side quest yet. Um, I was waiting on, uh, until I got Nia back before I did that. Again, chapter three. Yeah, I played Tiger Tiger. I did that. Uh, I did most of that off. Uh, well, I grinded that off screen uh, to try to build up Poppy. All right. Uh, okay. I'm gonna regret this. Uh, I hate 
can't chain attack yet. Topple, like, actually makes this stupid easy. Well, I got another. Ooh, that is a good. That is a good ox core for what it is right now. Did I gain a level? Well, Dina did. Alright, let's go. Off we go! What will we find? Yeah, I'll probably see. Uh, I'll probably end up seeing a uh, screen of uh, you being online. Okay, so we're going over here. Let's jump over here, and there's a chest down here, and I already fucked it up. Perception. All right, so let's walk across here. If you got anybody that uh, wants to uh, wa uh, watch, um, bring them in. Him, I bring them in. Let's show them that they won't break. We can do this together. Get back over here. Uh, where is this? Oh shit, it's that place. And hard no. Under right. <laughs> let's find a few la uh, let's find a few landmarks. Perhaps rest 
and enjoy view for a bit. Alright. Oh shit. Okay, time to take you down. Let's mess them up. What time is it? Right. It's 10:27. Oh man, I'm so spoiled. I'm so spoiled that later in the game, and you know why, Anthony. Oh, there he is. There you are. I'm so used to uh, I'm so used to uh, what Rex has later in the game. We can do this all day. No problem at all. Okay. Right, hangers passage. But first, I need to hop it onto the ship. Nice. And sweet. So you're technically, you're playing along. Oh, I'm going to regret this. I'm going to regret this. Come hither! I'm surprised that they, uh, I'm surprised that soldier did not just decide to... Come closer! If you want to get that for me for my birthday, I'll consider it. I 
should have done this blindfolded. We aren't the only thing that was blindfolded. Okay, time to take you down. You can do it, Rex Rex! Well, who are you gonna tell? Who are you gonna tell? Who are you gonna tell? No one. That's what I thought. Get wrecked. I need to set up my webcam again. I'll set uh, I'll set it up for uh, next stream or something. Some sometime soon. Wait, why are they running away? I don't get it. This one messed you up. All right, level 12 for Rex. I don't think I've had any had anybody uh, incapacitated yet in the entire playthrough yet. Well, actually, scratch that. Toro got incapacitated, but I haven't been able to revive him. So I still haven't been able to get that skill from Pyra yet. Last night, I, uh, like, I fell asleep playing Tiger Tiger. Like, it lulled me to sleep. And mind you, that was after eight hours of work. Oh yeah, I got some good, uh, I actually did get some good runs. Which is why I was able to power up Poppy so, mu uh, so much. Like, Poppy right now is a freaking tank. Alright, see that a floating icon? It's called the Heart to Heart Talk. Heart to Heart are important events that let party members glow, uh, grow closer as friends. You'll run into these icons throughout the journey. Oh! To view heart, heart to hearts, you'll have the right people present in your party at the right time of day. You can view the conditions by assessing the icon. The more heart to hearts you view, the bonds of trust and affinity between you and your blades will deepen. First off, Let's get that button done. Next up. That's taken care of. And three. Let's talk. The inside of a Titan battle ship is way different from the Minotaurus, sir. Eh? Why is Minotaurus? You saw it, right? Maud had a pier back in Goldsmith. Gin and Poe's back boat. Ah, that really impressive one. It runs without being hooked up to a title, right? Yeah, and the other hearts are hard, so really good. I'm no expert, but yeah, looks like it. Sound awesome! Tora want to see too! Won't 
get the chance. Unless we see those toner guys again. Change mine, no need to see. Master Bob, change mine at Dumb Up Hat. Well, the Minoceros are pretty sweet, but this is nothing to scoff at either. I'm not sure. It's full of things I've never seen before. Well, that's because this vessel is the result of latest breakthroughs in our Danium tech. Regular folk never so much as set foot on board. You say breakthroughs in technology, but what you mean is salvage stuff, right? Um, not exclusively. I see lots of homegrown improvements as well. Like this, see? Whatever they've stuffed in here, it's been messed with so much, I can't tell what it was to start with. That control panel, it transmits signal to tighten nerves. By running cables to different parts of Titan from here, can control signal flow much more better. Whoa! That's amazing. And this cable itself has 2.4 times the speed and 12 times the capacity of previous iteration. In other words, it's on whole other level to stuff other countries use. Ah. So if they put this in a smaller Titan vessel, it would work even better. Infon! They seem to be having fun, but it's all gibberish to me. Poppy, what do you think? Why, Master Pon act so proud? Hoo-hoo! Tora, very glad you asked. Not because tech used in this Titan battleship is same as what Poppy's muscles and flight train use. Poppy is surprised. But, however, though, what the Poppy use are even more improved than these here. Are you saying you stole the tech from Mora Day? Come on, Tora. Is that what you call sporting behaviour? Tora take calculated risk in service to cause of scientific advancement. I mean, Tora's not wrong. As a result, not even our Danian scientists capable of reverse engineer footy systems. So, no worries there. Upon learning people to puppy first, Poppy feels sense of unease. Uh, everything fine. Probably. Now, Rex Rex, no time for chit chat. Let's get going. Again, uh, I, uh, I mean, Tora's not wrong. Oh. <sighs> All right. Now that. Uh, Morning already? It is new day. It is new day. Tora's never wrong. Fuck you! Ah, not much further to exit! Not so fast, my dear intruder! Oh god, it's this Letting guy. a terrorist from Torna out of my grasp would make me look very bad indeed. Oh, that emerald core crystal! You must be the Aegis! Much as it pains me to admit it, it seems Borad was right on the money. You know who power is? Are you trying to capture it too, you ratbag? No, no, language! But of course, the most rat powerful bag. blade in all of history rat bag. with the power to rend all rest asunder! Only a fool would know of that power and not seek to claim it. And I am no fool. Therefore, I will claim her as my own. You cannot argue with such logic. Flaw detected in final step of logic. <laughs> <laughs> but you've done all the capturing you're going to do today. Such impertinence for a dirty terrorist. Let's go, Pyra. Got it. Poppy thinks you're stupid. Alright, uh, 
after such a long time talking about aggro, uh, after I've talked about aggro for so long, now we're talking about aggro. That's the red ring. That's who the enemy targets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, your tank always should draw the aggro. Your attacker with the most attack usually will draw the aggro. That is why it's important for your tank to draw the aggro. Three people on your team, blade com a ceiling effects of blade combos. Blah, blah, blah. I agree, Poppy is the best character. I'm actually bummed out that we never get this blade in New Game Plus. Even if we can regenerate, that doesn't mean blades don't feel pain. Although, I mean, it would just mean another shield hammer. I do feel pain. It's called a migraine. Because you're so damn stupid. I love how he's just running away from his blade. Ah, uh, damn it, that, uh, it didn't work. He said pineapple. <laughs> I think he said pineapple. I would have gotten away for it if one of you meddling kids and that damn dog for trying to execute me. What? He was trying to take me back to Mora Day. Rex, this is a trap. A trap? It's a trap house. I knew it. So they weren't actually going to execute you? No time! <laughs> Rex, Rex! We should escape! Master Pawn is right. Chance of reinforcements very high. Let us make haste. The getting out of town would be a good start. To be fair, I was talking about Gramps.
All right, so we got. <laughs> Do we? Uh, all right. <laughs> Oh, hold on, hold on, let me compose myself very quick, that was, oh, that was fucking funny. Uh, we got a patch expansion kit. Uh, these, uh, uh it'll boost, um, space for pouch items by one. I'm gonna give this to Tora because he needs the most help. Not saying that to be mean, but it's true. Woo! Super tasty treat for Tora! Yum yum! Resistance protocol deactivated. Yeah, it was, uh, yeah, uh, Emil did say, uh, Tora first. Alright, um, I'll say, uh, I like this scene better at night. Under right. <laughs> All in one piece. All right, now we're trying to run away. We're trying to run away. This is too easy. I don't like this. Huh. And with a driver too this time. That's Morag, the flame bringer. Morag. Special Inquisitor Morag of Morardain, the most powerful driver in the Empire and wielder of bridges. The most powerful blade. So together they're like ultra powerful. It looks like they were waiting for us. Yes, indeed. I did feel like we got away. Yeah, I did say. Uh, I did say I Morag is one of my favorite characters. To slow you down at all. It was you, right? You're the one who spread the rumor that I was going to be executed. Just to lure Rex and the others here. You catch on quickly. Yes. You certainly proved useful. However, Rex and Pyra are the real price. <laughs> Not quite. The Emerald Core Crystal is the sign of the Aegis. If that blade is indeed the Aegis, then there's something I must do. What do you mean? The power to sunder all rest itself. I cannot allow that to happen again. But she is just perfection. Pyra destroyed the world. Don't be so stupid. You mean you didn't know? 500 years ago. Orag is perfection. I don't want to hear it. The Aegis. Anyone can fight me on that. Sank three continents to the Cloud Sea's bed. Three titans destroyed. I speak not but historical fact. I'm on to you. You want to use Pyra as some kind of weapon. We're not going to let you do that. That is to be fair, the uh, to be fair, Morag is, isn't your typical waifu material, but resist? still. Then I will have to restrain you by force. I mean, her weapon, In that though. Case, I'll make this nice and clear. You will never take her. <laughs> then let's see if you have the strength to back up those words, boy. Okay, time to take you down. All right. Rex, let's go. We're facing Morag Ladair. Level 15. With Bridges by her side.
with the unique uh, weapon class of whip uh, whip swords. I wonder if she actually does her level 4 on her. Four specials already. Although I actually do want to finish her off with a uh, with burning sword. Trust me, my last stream, like, I struggled finding those two. Stubborn child, why don't you just give it up? But of course, this blade he calls Pyra. Your flames burn far stronger than hers, but her flames hide something deeper. Is everyone all right? Hang in, Inve. Uh, those two are very strong. <laughs> I know. 
At this rate, we'll never... It's like a fucking teddy bear. There has to be a way. Some kind of... She's a firefighter. Got to find... Water. There. Guys, are you ready to run? Sure. Then follow me. Ah, there they are. Pyra, can you manage a full-powered blast? Yes. Maybe one or two. That'll do. I love Counter Strike so much. It's such a good song. It's so hype. I feel slighted. How so? They actually held back against me in battle. You think that boy, did you not see? He could have struck me with that blow, but he averted his aim. He did have good instincts, too. And I'm gonna help her. I'm not going to let you stand in our way. The Aegis. If she is traveling with that boy, perhaps it is worth letting them roam free for a while. You mean... We'll cross paths again. And when we do, we shall see. I don't think they're following us. Perhaps we're safe for now. You're right. We should get some rest. I can't go any further. Oh, Tora is pooped as well. <sighs> See you later. Huh? We are grateful for all you've done. We wish you well on your travels. Farewell. I want to reach Elysium. What? I made a promise. I'm taking Pyra to Elysium. It's just... She gave half of her life to save mine. I owe her. Oh, Rex. But half the world seems to be after her. With the Titans dying off. Living space is running out. That's gonna start wars. 
and people need weapons to fight wars. That's why they want her. <sighs> if I can prove Elysium people exists, need swords to stab. maybe I can stop the war that's coming. But fighting Morag taught me something. I'm not strong enough. I can't do this alone. Nia, you're a driver. We could really use a companion like you. If you wanted. Elysium, do you really believe with that myth, kid? Well, Pyra told me that she was born there. Yet here she is. So it must exist. Right? <laughs> Your logic is almost as good as Dougal's. God, that's an insult. I don't know if you're stupid or just too nice for your own good. But what if Pyrus just lying? What if this is all an act and one day she turns around and stabs you in the back? Pyra wouldn't do that. Of course I wouldn't. I don't have a knife. So serious. She... <laughs> <laughs> An emerald core crystal is the sign of the ages, huh? Sure, why not? This could be interesting. Really? My lady. I kind of want to see this Elysium for myself now. Elysium. Maybe it really does exist. It does. An endless field of green among the clouds, huh? If the legends are true, even people like me. Ah, I'm sorry. Did I wrap it too tightly? It's fine. I'm fine. <laughs> I can swing it like this and it doesn't even... I knew it. Thanks. I feel much better now. I'm sure that's me as poultice doing its job. Thanks. Remember, don't wrap it too tightly. Pyra, you're hurt too. Are you okay? I'm fine. It's just a scratch. Hey, let me help. Thank you, Rex. No worries. Least I can do. There, all done. How's that? Hmm. Looks good. Um, Rex? Look, they're the same. Oh. Uh, yeah? Mm. I guess they are. <laughs> God, the graphics in this game is so beautiful. So beautiful. Yeah. It really is. I guess that's probably because you made it, Pyra. Oh. Um, no. What? So I didn't mean cute. it like that. Love it. Just, um, really good at making fires. That's all. Smooth. It's what I do. This scene just gives you the warm and fuzzies. Makes your heart melt. Mm. 
And that's the end of chapter two. I got roughly about 30 minutes. Give or take. Welcome home, Jin. Hey, Akos. I hear the Aegis awakened. Nasty shock for you? Or was it? Of course, my script showed how everything would play out from the start. Strong. Sure, you say that once it's all over and done with. It's easy to act smug when hindsight's on your side. Shut your mouth, Abrona. I'm shaking to my core. Where are the other two? Mikhail's inspecting the Ardanian factory. And my beloved sister is out hunting, as always. I'm sure she'll have found plenty of drivers to chew up and spit out by now. She likes to hunt, all right. Not sure we can use all of those core crystals, though. Do we know where the Aegis is right now? Have no fear, Jin. Of course we know her whereabouts. Abrona? Yeah, yeah. Hmm. It seems they're currently traveling away from the urban area of Gormont. Leaving the town? But there's nothing out that way. Perhaps they're on their way out of Gormod itself. Oh, and... What? It seems a certain shipment has set out. The core crystals heading to Indol for cleansing, huh? How pious of them. Shall we handle them? I can deal with that myself. You concentrate on the Aegis. Understood. Well, I am looking forward to clapping eyes on the Aegis. By the way, what of Nia? You know where she is? Yes. Look, this dot here. Without a doubt, this is Dromark's wavelength. It seems they're traveling together with the Aegis. With the Aegis? Huh. Do as you see fit. Understood. You don't need to ask me twice. Right then. We're gonna take the Monoceros. As you wish. Hey. Don't do anything too reckless. Whew. Starting out longer. What is that? Cloud Sea Compass. A must have for salvagers. It's sort of a map of the Cloud Sea. If you do this and this, what's the <laughs> date today? Um, a map October 5th, 4058. Okay. So now we put the date in. Would you uh, consider a gin, uh, Tyler? Oh, this is very clever. Looks like Gormot. Is the closest country to the world tree right now? All we need is a ship. The army has every ship in town in its grip. <sighs> We're kind of stuck. Seems that way. Sorry, I'm no use now. I know, I know. True. But I'm all out of ideas. Rex Rex needs ship. <gasps> Tora, have good idea. You do? There is shipbuilder living at Gormok Titan's Bum Bum. Old friend of Tora's Grampy Pon. He called Umon. Maybe he help if we tell him what's what. Sure, it's worth a shot. Ooh. Let's get going. Hey Tora. 
The place where, uh, uh, where this Umon guy lives isn't affected by the cloud sea tides, is it? Um, why Rex Rex Well, I know this the cloud sea's been pretty low ever since we went off to save Nia. It's still low now, right? I was worried, depending on the situation, we might be forced to take a different route. Rex has a point. The cloud sea tides can be marked effect. On a different area uh, areas, you are able to tra uh, able to traverse. Sometimes the cloud sea may allow you to swim places that were once out of reach, but equally, it can submerge previously reach uh, reachable areas, halting your progress. Exactly. So I was wondering whether we need to worry about any of that where we're going now. That makes sense, but it's no problem. Path to Shipyard of Uman not affected by Cloud Sea at all. That's good to know. If it was somewhere we could re uh, uh, reach only a high tide, we'd have to rest up somewhere until the clouds rise. That doesn't sound so bad to me. Frankly, I welcome the well-earned rest at an end while we wait for the tide to change. No offense, Rex, but your helmet isn't always the most comfortable abode. Yes, yes. You always have uh, you always have a stretch and a lie down. Next time we visit it in at Torgoth. For now, uh, for now though, we go to ship uh, shipyard of Uman. That's fair. Uh, Akos, uh, uh, yeah, Tyler, yeah. Uh, I'm uh, I'm I'm okay with that. All right, that's telling us you can actually change the tides uh, through the um, by staying at the end. All right, now we got a lot more things open up to us now. So. What to do? First up, I say we should get some landmarks. I would uh, I would say jewels because uh, well I would say jewels because of the hair and uh, I, don't, I don't know that's a tough call hey, look what I found. all right this is a uh, no Celia's uh, timber site. Chip. Did I miss? All right. Next up, let's go and find some more uh, landmarks to find. Yeah, it's better to find these landmarks now. <laughs> Before the next stream, oh shit! I uh, I can't remember. Um, I wield this power to protect my friends. I'm trying to remember. There was there was somebody. I believe my usefulness has increased. It's something to do with goggles.
Or I could be thinking of a different blade. I probably am. Okay, bring it up. And I'm gone. No. Leave me alone. Wow, what has many amazing places in it? All right. Perhaps Wes can enjoy this. This uh, uh, this uh, landmark is actually the first part of the uh, left upper level of Gormont. And that's where we go, uh, where we have to go to get to uh, Uman, uh, Uman Shipyard. Uh, let's see. All right, uh, uh, stream and okay. Uh, now what I'm going to do, uh, let's head to Boulder Boar Gate. Because there is one, um, there is a point, uh, there is a landmark that is very important. Excuse me, Turkin. Oh shit, I about, about made a boo-boo. I'm surprised those things didn't attack us. Would you look at that? That is quite something. What have we here? Welcome to the first seeker area of the game. Seeker areas. They get uh, they give you a lot of stuff. If you have the right field skills for, and two, Treasure acquired. sometimes give you good stuff. Oh shit, uh, I about fell. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now. For the rest of this stream, which is about eh, about nine minutes or so, I'm gonna unlock two uh, uh, two blade uh, uh, two rare blades, one for Rex and one for Nia. Nia's has already been chosen, which, uh, was, uh, and it's a DLC blade. Let's see which one is it. No, that's not it. This one. A firecracker of a gal. Which, uh, we'll go pick up in a bit. And that is, you'll go to the Argentum Trade Guild. That was a slog. That's a slog. 
And then we go to the Bauer Lounge. We go to Hurry Scurry. And uh, apparently Corinne gave us a package with a core crystal. Ebolent core crystal. Ebolent, I, I don't know how to pronounce that. Uh, let's go to, and eh, let's go to the grotto. I don't grab it. Crystal. Cross set is the first DLC blade. And if you look at her stats, you can see why. Made her the best bitball class blade in the game. Everything balanced. A great element. But we'll, uh, again, we'll go over her later, which will be the next uh, Xenoblade stream. All right. I need, uh, wait, wait. I need to follow my advice. I need to follow my advice. I need to put uh, I need to put a choker on him. Hey, I wonder if uh, I have any blades that uh, have luck on them. Do I have luck? Do I have luck? Do I have luck? I don't. All right, so it doesn't even matter. I mean, that'd be interesting. Like, do you actually know my pity blades?
Because I honestly don't. Like, I honestly have him accounting. Like, I have a feeling a zombie was my first pity blade. Wait. Oh, god damn it. Never mind. I hate everything. I hate everything. Ah! Oh, Godfrey. Two shield hammers! What the hell? Oh, and just so you know, I just uh, I just remembered. Godfrey is the one to deal with the goggles that, uh, uh, for its um for one of its skills. I'm gonna get, uh, I'm gonna keep going. No. I refuse. Oh, at least I got freaking Godfrey out of the way. Uh, I gotta take a call. Be right back. Thank you. 
Yeah, sorry about that. Um, I had to take a call from one of uh, one of my bosses at work. But yeah, um, I d uh, yeah I don't want to end the stream on Godfrey. No, that is a s that is a sin in itself. And you never end a stream on Godfrey. Hashtag don't end on Godfrey. I'll lend you my strength. Never end on Godfrey. Another lady blade. everything. All right. That situation happens. It's time to get rid of blades. Do I have any that have a luck mod on them? Ooh. You might be useful. All right. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. So I wasn't strong. Just make sure I don't get rid of the one that. No, you have the salvage uh, salvaging mastery. Bye, Karen. Alright, uh... Oh, he's gonna use a Justice Booster. I don't need any more Knuckle Blades. I think this is the, uh... Yeah, this is the one, uh... Oh, that's a oh, that's a lock bond. No, oh, no, no, no. That's great. Okay. All right. So now, let's get that luck bond. Looking forward to working with you again. Yeah, that's what. Uh, yeah, I'll check that uh, check that list, and I'll I'll mark the uh, I'll mark those blades whenever I um, get to that point. Yeah, because trust me, that was a pain in the ass. Uh, Okay.
All right. Put three boosters. Damn it, uh, I actually wouldn't have mined the second one. I believe, uh, as like a female, um, I think a female, um, shield hammer was one of them. Yes! Fixed my mic on that one. Gorg is one of the ones I wanted. Uh, was one of the ones I wanted on Rex. Because uh, Rex needed a launch art. You suck. I give you my all. So now with uh, so now with this team I have here, I have a break art in Nia, topple art in Tora, and a launch art in Rex. I'm content with that. Ooh. Let's give him the wing uh wing jump right now. <laughs> hey, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Big red four and uh, uh, four and uh, five six. Welcome. Let's see. Uh, 
for aux cores. Uh, um, let's see. What can uh, what can we use? I mean, critical would be nice. Uh, I don't really have much. I didn't. Even, uh, I didn't even see on. Uh, I didn't even see on screen uh, about the follow. Holy shit! I have not gotten a knuckle claw on Nia yet. Um. Right now, the uh, the uh, blades I have on Nia are Dromark, Azami, and now Crossette. Yeah, I didn't, uh, like I didn't even uh, I didn't even see that. Holy shit! I need uh I'm surprised uh I'm surprised I didn't hear that. But yeah, uh, but yeah, that's um but yeah. Thank you for uh, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. Yeah, uh, and like it, it really mean uh, it really means a lot to me. Um, like I'm actually stoked that I got Gorg, uh, Gorg on Rex. Um, let's see. Uh, I'm trying to uh, I'm trying to think of what to uh, what to do right now. Uh. Uh, what was uh well I guess uh I can show a few things for instance that uh know that uh Rex like drinks having this makes me real happy yeah that's uh, that's what I was saying that um uh, I was happy uh, getting gored because of the launch art. Yeah. Uh, yes, I have a Discord. Uh, let me see if I could uh, post that on here. Let's see. Uh, hold up. Uh, do, 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 do. How the hell? Uh, how the hell do I frickin' do that? Uh, how the hell do I send it? Uh, wonder if that yeah it's still uh, this uh, this is all still new to me I'm still trying to figure this uh, I figure all this out but um I do have, uh, I do have a, um, like, I do have a YouTube channel, and then, um, uh, a Facebook channel that, I, uh, a Facebook that I, um, basically, uh, uploads, uh, upload stuff. And, um, that's, and then I usually, um, 
like I usually get in. Um, ta uh, send stuff through um, Snapchat and all that. Just a uh, typical. Uh, I'm st uh, like I'm still trying to learn Discord and all that. Let's see. Yeah, I'll figure it out later. Anyway, back to uh, back to the game. Uh, I was gonna say I hope that uh, I hope the Narsa Pear Jelly is the only all right. I do have a uh, dessert, which is a uh, favorite treat. Was one of um, Gork's favorite things, and if I remember correctly, how did you know exactly? Shit, what no, I it's not that. I think it was either game or textiles, or was it art? Thanks. No, nope, it wasn't that. Son of a bitch. Yeah, I am. Uh, like, I am on a, uh... Let's, uh, go to Garagon's Arch. Because there are places I have not gone yet. Up we go! What will we find? Well, at least I got key 9 from Gorg. Oh, I plan, uh, I plan to for, uh... Whenever I try to take down that unique monster later on in the, um... On the left side of Gormont. Yeah, because I'm going to need all the help I can get on that one. Because the next, uh, next stream is going to be doing a lot of quests and trying to get to uh, Uman. Which, uh... Oh. <laughs> Alright, I guess that works. Oh. Trying, to, uh, trying to get over here. Uh, I know this will be important. This, this, this. I have not fought him yet, but I also have to fight him. I was thinking of, um... I was thinking that bird on the left side. I can't remember his name. in we have finally reached full circle um, but now um, I have to get ready for work so I'm gonna have to cut the stream here um, 
So, um, next stream is actually going to be tomorrow. I believe what I'm going to actually try to do is um, stream sometime between 4 and 6 o'clock. It's actually going to be, uh, uh, I'm going to be streaming, um, yeah, so, uh, sorry, man, like, I kind of caught the, uh, kind of caught, like, the tail end of it, uh, uh but, uh, I'm going to be streaming, uh, uh I'm going to be, uh, uh, I'm going to be streaming, uh, Chrono Cross for, uh, uh for most of the day. It's uh, actually my all-time favorite video game, and I'm actually going to have a guest on the channel. So, um, if you guys, uh, guys want to check it out, feel free to come by. Uh, I'll, I'll be posting, um, uh, I'll be posting. But anyway, uh, thank, uh, thank you all for watching, um, VOD, uh, uh, um, uh, Big Red, if you want to, uh, watch the VOD, uh, it'll be up on the channel, uh, be up on, uh, Twitch if you want to, uh, if you want to watch, uh, uh, what, uh, went on. Um, but, yeah, I appreciate the follow, man. Um, the next, uh, what I'm, what I think I'm going to be doing, um, on Sunday... At three o'clock, the first half of the stream is going to be Xenoblade, and then the second half is going to be either going to be Mario Party or Mario Kart. I haven't decided yet, and then we'll go from there. So usually, uh, usually I stream on Wednesdays. Uh, that's uh, solely Xenoblade. Uh, Saturday for the for the, uh, the foreseeable future will be Chrono Cross, and then um, Sunday will be uh, a mixture between Xenoblade and uh, some sort of Mario game for uh, the foreseeable future. So um, that being said. Thank, uh, thank you all for watching, and um, I'll uh, see you all um, tomorrow. Uh, take care.